See this? This is the key to the vault at Nightingale Conant. I'm here recording my latest program, The Abundance Paradigm. I'm having a blast doing it, but somebody told me just the other day that there's actually a vault here. There is a treasure someplace on the second floor that has everything Nightingale Conant has ever created in the last 50 years. I immediately said, I'm in the secrets. I want to see this secret. I want to film this secret, and I want to show you what the secret is. If you follow me, we'll go to the Holy Grail. First impression, dark, musky, spooky, great place for a treasure. There's a light on this area, so I'm going to go exploring down here. I'll be able to see what I'm looking at. What most people don't know is I may have many programs with Nightingale Conant myself, but I listened to Nightingale Conant cassettes back in the early 80s when I was struggling, when I was broke, when I was unpublished, when I was unknown, when nobody cared, including me. And I listened to this stuff. Here's Reprogram Your Subconscious Mind. The One Minute Millionaire. That's fairly recent stuff. But I listened to this material when I was struggling, when I was trying to make a difference in my life, when I was trying to become something and become somebody. And one of the very first, look at this, look at this. One of the very first programs I ever listened to was How to Be a No Limit Person, Wayne Dyer's program. How to be a no limit person, is this too wild? Because what do I teach today? I teach zero limits. I teach the missing secret of the secret to attracting money. My new program, The Abundance Paradigm, it's all about being a no limit person. This, is, this influenced me in the early 80s. And here it is, up in this vault. Ah, and look, this is one of the all time classics, Thinking Grow Rich, Napoleon Hill. One of the most influential, I'm getting choked up, one of the most influential programs of all times. And it's a Nightingale Conan, obviously, there's the name, product. And it's here in this vault. Oh, good, nice. I need to be left alone up here. I got the key now, so I can be doing it. There is just so much here. Leo Buscalia, love. Leo Buscalia, I got to meet him at one point. I was still struggling in Houston. He was doing an autograph party. And I stood in line with my wife at the time for two hours to meet that guy. You know why it took two hours? Because when you sat with him, he was in no hurry. He spent time with you. He loved us. He lived love. He lived love. Didn't know us at all. Didn't know us from Adam. The strangest secret. Look at this. Wow. The strangest secret in the mind of man. Look at this binder. Look at that. This is, this is Holy Grail. This is national treasure. They can make a movie about coming in here and finding the wisdom of these authors that have been around for so long. Leo Buscalia again, loving each other. One of his early, look at that nice smile. He was a very loving person. Oh, he even signed this one. As we continue to grow in love, warmly, Leo Buscalia. Ugh. He was a sweet man, he was a loving man, and look at this on cassette. I did hear that Nightingale is coming out with three more, or three of the older editions of these on CD, so we'll be able to get these and relive them again. Strongly encourage you to listen to Leo Buscalia. In fact, all of these, if they're being brought back to life, and they're on CD or DVD or however you can get them today, look in the catalog, look at Nightingale.com, and restock on this stuff there are so many things we can go on and on in fact i want to be left alone up here why are people watching me look at this stuff we got closing the sale overcoming price resistance brian tracy was another one i listened to in those days he's still cranking out stuff he is still doing wonderful uh, dale carnegie the classics are all here dale carnegie tom peters the classics nightingale conan has probably been more responsible for finding and distributing the wisdom of the universe than any other organization I can ever think of, especially with the audio material. When it comes to, here's Inspire Your Divine Purpose, another Wayne Dyer, here's something of Mother Teresa. There is gold here. Nightingale has gold, and shame on them for not bringing a lot of this back out. Psycho-Cybernetics, that's Dan But there are a lot of gems that have been lost here, a lot of gems that are still sitting on the shelf that need to be dusted off, that need to be put on CD, and I'm going to really put Nightingale's feet in the fire and say, look, Mr. Fire wants this stuff on CD. Let's get it out there for the world. The thing I would say to anybody is go to Nightingale.com and explore all of their products. 
There are hundreds of items there, thousands here. They've been doing this since 1960, 50 years of celebration. And I'm just going to keep the key and lock myself in up here. Joe Vitale, over and out.